what's going on my youngest what's going on youtube og back at you with another one trying to get off there with pressure boulevard before i get my ass knocked off listen we talking about everything big juke this morning no hate in my heart but no celebration but before this old south memphis og speak on this whole situation with big juke Y'all please hit that like button, respectfully comment. I will respond respectfully. And continue to support me. All right, y'all. I'm not gonna lie like I'm bringing this video with a heavy heart about what happened to your guy, this brother, because it was a lot of things said and done. And I, me being just like a lot of other South Memphis men, OGs and the whole name just did not like the whole energy that you know, Big Juke was coming from when we lost Young Dog. See, even though we older and we out the way, we still love our youngins. And honestly, by Big Juke being one of the oldest and before the end, still kind of being eyed as an OG, even though he was an op, he still was looked up on as, old, as an OG in my eyes. And I'm old, uh, Bellevue and Beachwood, Clementine apartment, my sister and nephews and everybody come up over there and cascade you what we call dog land. So, you know, I am qualified to speak on these things. But I ain't gonna lie like I'm celebrating. The only reason why I'm talking about this video right now and getting it out is, is to let y'all know that that dog land in South Memphis is okay. They, we're not sitting around today celebrating. We're not laughing. We don't think that it's funny. We've done our share of grieving and crying and, and you know, the whole nine. And we honestly feel like the whole beef with your guy there Big Joe came to a head and we lost young, young dog behind that. And that's why we're not happy, but we're not sad neither. So don't be putting Memphis at war. Because this man... Gang guy, don't don't put Memphis at war. Memphis is one of the only cities where truly, if you said something two years ago or 20 years ago, and it was too much and too far, we got long memories. Am I lying, big bro? Right. I got my OG brother here, Black, with me, riding with me today. I might be OG, but Black Triple OG from the streets of South Memphis. So yeah, we qualified, we just riding and talking. It ain't time to smoke yet. But we just riding and talking because we hate what's going on today on how they trying to label it like Memphis is, ain't, is gonna be a war zone. Memphis ain't gonna be nothing, man. We still out here hustling. We still out here being safe. Karma has to come to everybody. Whether your name, Young Gotti or whoever. Karma. I done told y'all out here whether y'all consider y'all self OG, youngin' or whatever. Quit wishing harm upon other people, not realizing that the same cup that you laughing at I'm drinking from, your ass gonna have to drink from. So yo got it, you gotta drink from this cup too. What did y'all think? Man, the streets are still suffering from young dogs, young uh young dogs lost. Still suffering, and we still didn't go to war. Still didn't. No, they, they predicted it then. Like it's the end of South Memphis. No, man, we living our best life right now. We know Young Dog wouldn't have wanted all these youngers to self-destruct behind his loss. Him being lost. Just like we know for a fact Young Dog wouldn't want our youngers out here crashing out because we had to take that L. Point blank period. But y'all want to try it right today, try and make it seem like uh, Memphis, especially South Memphis, is a powder keg, powder keg about, man, man, listen, I'm here right here, right now, and the hustle's still going on, the people still talking, the people ain't it's still out, ain't nobody dug in the hide, because we understand in South Memphis what karma is. And we know for you to receive karma, we don't have to lay a hand on you. If y'all just want to hear the truth. 
All I can tell y'all to do is call the t-shirt man. Go on, get them t-shirts together. Go on, show that brother Big Jup all the love and honor that y'all feel like he deserves. But don't put the rest of Memphis in it and leave South Memphis out of it. Because like the police said, ain't no suspects. And the only thing they can say is that they they know some people seen something. Ain't nobody telling nothing. We from Memphis. This ain't. We ain't looking for no uh, blue ribbons for snitching around here, y'all. But yeah, I just want everybody to know today. For a There ain't no war going on right here, and we ain't on pins and needles, and we ain't doing none of that over here. Not off, not off Bellevue and Beachwood. Not off Saxon. Not off Mississippi Boulevard. No. Nothing going on in Memphis. But another homicide, y'all. Y'all let us make it. We don't know what happened to that brother. But I can't tell y'all today that South Memphis is not celebrating it. And you don't see nobody out celebrating. Me and Triple OG right now, ain't nobody out celebrating that young brother demise. Like I said, we consider moves like this karma. Because the stuff he said. And was rumored to be done was years ago. So when when you say or do things years ago, being from Memphis, you accept the responsibility that if you was right, karma you will remain untouched. But if you were wrong, karma come to get you. It's up to y'all to make the decision. Y'all pray for my city of Memphis, man. But Memphis is not on edge. And Memphis is not finna have no blood, man. And Memphis is not at war with no camp. No South Memphis Negro is gearing up, peeking out no trap house windows, out of the back of no buses, talking about they waiting on something to jump off. We letting Memphis finest deal with this crime. We're gonna be the, we're gonna remain. The good, non-violent, loving South Memphis Negroes we always be. Much love to Dogland.